Yo, it's your boy. <laughs> Yo, it's your boy Picante Nino coming at you with another video. Today we're going to be remaking our old Berserker movement guide. I'm going to be poking fun at this and honestly like hopefully you guys like this new style of editing. It's going to be kind of weird for me but hopefully it works out and if you guys like it, like it. If not, like just, you know, whatever. You know, that that's cool. It's some cool information. But yeah, so let's just jump into it. The new remade Berserker movement guide. Berserker guide. So yeah, let's jump into it. Yo, it's your boy Picante Nino coming at you with another Zerker guide. We are going to be going over movement combos this time. Movement combos are really important in PvP, especially for Zerkers. Zerkers is a class that relies on movement more than most classes. With that in mind, let's start off with the easy movement combos. The first movement combo we are going to be going over is by far the easiest. All you gotta do is just move forward while holding down left click and spamming right click. The next movement combo is Shake Off into an auto attack into any direction you want. Now let's move on to the more complicated movement combos. In order to do this movement combo, you're going to want to move forward, then Shake Off, then quickly tap the F key. If you hold down the F key for too long, it would either cancel you into Titan Step or into Giant Leap. This movement combo uses the least amount of resources out of all the other combos, so you could spam this for days without even have to worry about your stamina or your potions. Next combo is Titan Step into Shift, Left, or Right, then Forward Right Click. This movement combo is used to play defensively because you can cancel it into Crouch Shot at any time. The crowd shot gives you soup nothing literally nothing no protection no nothing back then it did no not now but the downside to this movement combo is that it uses a lot of resources so use this whenever you're playing defensively the next movement combo is by far the most complicated but yet it is the best movement combo out of all the other combos due to how fast and how far you move with this combo in order to do this combo, you're going to want to do forward right click into forward F into shift left or right. Sounds simple, but it gets really complicated to redo it. If you are having trouble with any of these movement combos, you should try weighing your character down so you can practice the combos at a much slower pace. So the more weight you have on them, the slower the movement becomes. The next movement combo is exactly like the last movement combo, but with the beastly wind slash in the middle of it to give us a speed buff. Once we obtain the speed buff, then we cancel the beastly wind slash into a lava piercer. This is one really good movement combo if you want to chase someone for a long period. But before we get into this combo, we got to know how to cancel beastly wind slash into a lava piercer. In order to achieve this, we are going to want to do Beastly Wind Slash into F, into Forward F, into Shift, Left or Right, into a Lava Piercer. Here's how it should look like when done correctly. You use your movement combo to wait out the Lava Piercer cooldown. And when your Lava Piercer is up, you cancel into Lava Piercer so you can keep up with your target. You keep on repeatedly doing this until you catch your target. And that's the end of the Zerker Guide. Hope you guys enjoyed. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. If you guys have any more suggestions on future content, please post them down in the comments below. And if you guys are interested in seeing my live Twitch stream, the link is in the description. Thank you guys, and see you guys next time. Whoa. Whoa, it's like we took like a five year, you know, blast from the past, you know? Hopefully that was enough, but there's actually like two more things I want to show you guys because you know Obviously the Zerkers have some new tech man. We're always looking. We're always grinding man So I'm gonna show you guys the new uh, the new movements for uh, you know 2023 um, Literally, it's just only two things if you know this video from five years ago, it's still relevant 
So yeah, let's just show the new tech, man. Let's jump into it. Okay, so let's get into the new Zerker movement that we all love. So in order to do this uh, Zerker movement, you're going to have to actually hotbar uh, Flame Buster to your hotbar. So for me, my hotbar is down on the number 6 key. So make sure make sure you have a hotbar of Flame Buster, wherever it's very comfortable for you to press. So whenever you do shake off like this move right here, you know how, you notice how there's a little bit of recoil right now? So like right here, I'm like spamming right click and my character isn't going faster, right? So what you do to cancel that recoil is by starting up your Flame Buster from hotbar. You see how I lift up my hand? We're canceling the recoil of the Flame Buster with Flame Buster, which is pretty crazy, right? It's pretty high, high tech. It's uh, actually a frame zero cancel, so you never actually see this come out. So what you do next is that whenever you see the recoil of this right here, you actually spam the Flame Buster hotkey in between the right clicks, okay? So once you do that and you're getting used to hitting Flame Buster in between it, it actually looks like this. Hold on. You, you see how there is no recoil between those? So that's how you could cancel the recoil between your, your spamming your shake off and awakening like this. So let, let's look at it again. Just so you guys can get like a comparison of how it feels like. It isn't much of a difference, but it's still pretty noticeable. You see how I'm like instantly just leaping forward without the recoil from that? Another thing that it is extremely cool about this is that it actually works better in sideways motion. So the only thing that kind of sucks about it is that you have to actually have shooting mobility down so you can do it. So this is me doing sideways motion. And you don't need to be holding down left click. So that's how you move with a with Flame Buster. So all you're doing is just hitting um, right click and then just spamming your, your Flame Buster hotkey to move the sideways version of it. It actually gets you like pretty far away. So yeah. That's how you move with Zerker, man. That's the new tech. If you guys don't know how to already, uh, what's that called? Move with Zerker when it, when it comes to like shooting mobility and click to move, there is a video on how to show you how to click to move. But another secret movement that we do too, that I was also putting on pressure is just, uh, Shooting mobility, clicking to move in the opposite direction, which is behind you, and yeah. So let me show you the, the the two strats again, right? So this is with recoil. This is without recoil. And then if you do the sideways motion, it it becomes even more ridiculous. Also, if you have your attack speed and movement speed up, you actually just teleport and desync around. But let me show you guys that. So yeah, that's how you uh, move with Zerker. And it, it took me a long time to like actually master this in the, in the middle of a fight. So yeah, just use this whenever you're trying to like go farm mobs or anything. So what you do is that you could change the direction. So you could go like this. And then you could go into a Lava Piercer, you know, do all the other moves that I taught you about. So yeah, it's just like mixing and matching everything that was in the five minute video or three minute video that I did five years ago. And with that, you guys, Check out my stream, please. Help me out, dude. I'm, I'm dying over here. I'm dying over here. So every Fridays, you know, after, what, 7 p.m. EST, I'm going to be streaming. Check me out, dog. Link down below, please. And with that, you guys, uh, see you guys later, man. Dab on the floor.